Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. So, you've probably heard by now that Sony's been eyeing up Katakawa Corporation, the parent company of Elden Ring developers from software. Well, it turns out they're not just interested in acquiring a small part of them but actually wanting to buy out the whole thing. Katakawa's CEO, Takshi Natsuno, recently confirmed that Sony has received an initial letter of intent to acquire all their shares, and this move is expected to shake things up for the gaming industry. Now, we know that From Software is one of Katakawa's most successful game developers. But what about other properties like anime and video games? It seems that Sony's only interested in strategic investments in these areas, while Katakawa wants a more complete takeover. And it's not just Sony they're looking at, Microsoft Tencent, and even Kakao Corp from South Korea are all reportedly interested parties. But here's the thing, Katakawa is a Japanese media conglomerate with a rich history dating back to 1945. They've got an impressive portfolio that includes film studios, streaming platforms, and of course, from software. But Sony is only really after their anime and gaming libraries. Now, we can't help but wonder what this means for the future of these beloved franchises. Will we see more From Software games under Sony's umbrella? Or will they focus on developing new properties? The consequences of all this are already starting to be felt. In February, Sony cut 8% of their PlayStation workforce and recently shut down the London studio as part of those layoffs. And just last month, Firewalk Studios was closed entirely. It's worth noting that acquiring a proven studio like From Software is a smart move for Sony. It can help boost their bottom line and avoid some of the financial risks associated with developing live service games. But at what cost? We're already seeing massive layoffs across the industry, and it's hard to predict what the future holds. So, only time will tell if Sony's acquisition plan comes to fruition. One thing's for sure. This is going to be a wild ride, and we'll be keeping a close eye on how things play out.